Alexander Zverev versus Stefano Tsitsipas. It's a blockbuster third round matchup in the Monte Carlo Masters for 2024. And both have been really good at the tournament so far. Tsitsipas came into the tournament as the number 12 in the world and has had a pretty poor season so far with a win-loss record of 11 wins and 6 losses, which is far from what he was 12 months ago. His best result so far was a semi-final in Los Cabos, where he eventually lost to Casper Ruud in a close straight set. But that's the only semi-final that he's made this year. His best win was against Tiafo in Indian Wells, who was number 18 in the world at the time. So no top 10 wins yet for Steph this year. His worst loss came against Shapovalov in Miami in a very easy straight sets loss, and Shapo being 126 in the world. His form also has been really sketchy, coming into this tournament with a couple of losses. However, he did win both his matches so far this week, including a really easy win over Echeverry in the previous round. Zverev entered the tournament as the number five in the world and has had a really decent season so far with an 18 win, six loss record for the season. His best result so far is a semi-final multiple times in multiple tournaments, but the big one being at the Australian Open where he eventually lost to Medvedev in a close five setter. He has also made the semifinals of Miami, Los Cabos, and of course won the United Cup with Team Germany, but that Australian Open semifinal is the standout. His best win was against Carlos Alcaraz at the Australian Open, who was number two in the world at the time, beating him in four sets. His worst loss, however, was against Altmaier, in Acapulco, who was number 57 at the time, he lost to him in a three-setter. His form has been pretty good, having made the semifinals and quarterfinals of his last two events over the Sunshine Double. And he's also had a win this week against Ovna in the second round match before this one. These two guys have played 14 times before, with Tsitsipas holding a 9-5 record over Zverev. However, Zverev did win their last match that was at the United Cup earlier this year. But on the clay court, Steph has won four of their five matches and a straight sets win here in Monte Carlo a couple of years ago as well. So on the clay, Steph would like his chances better. If Sissipas is going to win this one, he needs to bring variety to Zverev and also be aggressive and serve well. He knows how to win this. He's won this two out of the last three times. And he's also got a pretty good draw if he can get through this matchup. But he has been low on confidence, so it's going to be interesting to see if he can use those happy memories of the previous tournaments he's played here. If Zverev's going to win this one, he needs to grind out the rallies. Also serve well. If he doesn't serve well, he won't beat City Pass. And he's also got to maybe be a little bit more aggressive than he usually is. Also, the backhand is going to be huge for Zverev in this one. Very fun matchup. I can't believe this is a third round match. This should be the final. It's absolutely insane. But I've got to go with Zverev in this one. In a close three sets, I feel like Zverev this year compared to City Pass is just much better. And that's why I've got to pick Zverev in three. But let me know down in the comments below who's making it to the quarterfinals.